seemed like they were pretty prepared. Oh, we do actually have Zonic ready to go. join us. Go, uh, thank you so much for taking the time. Uh, congratulations on a pretty decisive win there on Nuke. W were you expecting it to be Nuke? Because we were kind of flirting with the idea that it might be Vertigo coming into the mix. Were you expecting this? Yeah, I think it was one of them. But at least on statistics, we look really poor on Nuke. Uh, even though I think we have been doing really well in practice. So I, I kind of expected the new pick and I also understand why they picked it. During the first half, you had a couple of timeouts and you were quite vocal, it seemed. Uh, can you tell us what you told the guys? Are you trying to keep them a little bit under control? I mean, they were getting a little bit too, uh, how to say, feisty or cocky, if you can say that. <laughs> um, feeling the game a bit too much, talking about the last round instead of talking about what's what's in it here. And I just told them to, to stay focused and don't talk about the previous round, focus on what we're going to do in the next. And just in terms of coming on to Dust2, it's going to be your pick. Um, are you seeing this as a 2-0, Zonic? Ah, uh, I mean, it's... Uh, Not cocky. Uh, no, no. <laughs> I, I always like to be a bit humble. So, uh, yeah, we don't underestimate any Brazilian yeah. teams. I think that would be a big mistake. So, for me, it's about to go out to the guys and tell them that they should reset and, and focus for, for the next map. Well, thank you so much for joining us. Yeah, we'll let you go and get thank prepared you. for thank that you. dust too. Excited to see how that does go down.